Hey everybody, Bill with Bad Dog. Just following up on the video from actually a couple days ago now of the uh, two truths and a lie story challenge, which we had a lot of fun with. We're about to reveal the results. Lots of comments. Thank you for weighing in on it. Um, some funny stuff and questions around here. Um, so we'll ask Mr. Adam Pelly first. Adam, your story about the snake and the bucket catchers. Yep. Truth or lie? One hundred percent truth. I spent twelve years down there, and that's not the first. And that wasn't the only snake I seen down there. Lots of snakes. Uh, like I said, uh, when I tell the story, a lot of time they can get them with the bucket. <laughs> the snake handler comes and he picks them up and he puts it in the bucket. But the look on his face when he was called in on this like fifteen foot python was a riot. He definitely needed a bigger bucket. Uh, it was true, Mr. Thomas. <clears throat> Your story about swimming through an alley after you were roofied. Truth or lie? It wasn't roofies. I think it was acid. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, I, so I guess it was the truth? <laughs> it was absolutely the truth. And not only did it happen, there's witnesses who would see this. And the girl who drugged me actually put her phone number in my, in my pocket. And we called her when I got back to the hotel. <laughs> it was a good night. So that leaves me, the professional wrestling death match with the pane of glass. I can tell you that is 100% a lie. I did have another character under a mask called Shadow, but the closest I've ever been arrested for wrestling uh, was in Bridgewater, Nova Scotia, where I incited a riot uh, with a couple other guys. And that was about it. So that's the thing. Bill Bill's, killed a guy with a trident. <laughs> it escalated quickly. Jesus, <laughs> Aquaman. Bill's the liar. <laughs> Thank you, everybody.